you could help with an overflow of fur friends at the Mower County Humane Society. KIMT News 3's Maureen Dudley is taking us to this shelter to give us a rundown of volunteer duties. The Mower County Humane Society is a volunteer-based organization and they need more help than ever, especially with dogs like Toby and his friends. If you want to be a volunteer, here's what you need to do. You can sign a waiver online or download a form to fill out. Completed applications can be dropped off at the Humane Society. Board Vice President Liz Coughlin says it's a fulfilling way to give back to your community. Oh, I love it. I wouldn't be here over 20 years if I didn't like it. Of course, I like all kinds of animals. And all mine are from here. Once your application is accepted, the Humane Society will assign you some tasks. We usually start them with walls, windows, and waters, because that's in a sense the easiest, but it's very important. Volunteers will get some quality time with the animals, filling up those food bowls and having some playtime outside. We're all volunteers. If we didn't have volunteers, dogs wouldn't get done. We get a lot of people that ask us, um, if it's a holiday, do we still do the dogs? Well. Do you still eat on a holiday? The Mower County Humane Society is at capacity with 33 dogs and over 100 cats staying in the shelter. Volunteers are needed to help take care of the dogs and cats in the mornings and the dogs need help in the evenings as well. If somebody could commit to even one for sure day a week that they know they would be here, it would greatly help. If you want to volunteer, you'll be helping dogs just like Toby get the help they need. In Austin, Orion Dudley, KINT News 3. If you spotted a potential forever pet in that video, you'll need to make an appointment with the Mower County Humane Society. The shelter does not have open appointment hours.